Hi, this is Tony from Good Japan, Bad Japan, and today we're going to take you to Rabbit Island. So come along for the ride. Okay, so I'm inside the gift store. This is where you can buy your tickets, but you can find a lot of rabbit themed merchandise. So if you like rabbits, this is a good place for you. If you want a special themed photograph, you can get that here. Over there is the times for the ships. So we are taking, we are taking the 12 o'clock ferry over to the island. And over here is the tickets. Tickets are very cheap. 620 yen for a round trip for an adult, so that's pretty good. Okay, so let's give you an idea of the pier here. It's a beautiful, gorgeous day. Said it might rain, but I think we're going to get lucky. The ferry ride is only 15 minutes to Okunoshima, which is the Rabbit Island. Here's the main building where we bought the ferry tickets and where you can get some gifts. Oh, there's Itsumi. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> okay, very nice. And one thing that's very important to note when you're here is that if you want to feed the rabbits, you have to buy the food before you go to the island. They do not sell food on the island. So inside here, we saw that the price for food was about 200 yen per bag, and that's a bit much. But over here, over here by the bathrooms, you can find it for 100 yen. So half price rabbit food. So when you're traveling overseas, and you want a better rate on your rabbit food, go next to the bathroom. Don't go into the nice clean store. So, okay, let's go in and get some rabbit food. I've got my rabbit food, four bags. We're gonna go feed some rabbits. Go on that ship over there. So let's go. Okay, so we got our seat, we're, we're on the ship, we're about to leave. Now, here are some rules for the island. Pretty please, from the rabbits. Do not chase or carry the rabbits. Okay, no, no promises on that one. Do not touch rabbits on the road, roadside, or in front of the entrance. Uh, no promises there. Do not put your fingers nearby rabbit's mouth. Um, I'm surprised that S is so far from the apostrophe, but yeah, common sense. I'm not going to put my fingers in a rabbit's mouth. Do not feed human food. Okay, no problem. Do not litter. And do not leave your pet rabbit in the island. Pet rabbits cannot live in nature. Ah, so. I guess there are people who actually will bring their rabbits and let them loose on this island. That's crazy. So we made it. 
Uh, Itsumi and I made it to Okonoshima, or as it's otherwise called, Rabbit Island. So here's Rabbit Island. We are here. We are at a resort. This is a, uh, can you show the, yeah, this is a hotel. You can, you can stay at this hotel if you want to go camping. Well, no, that they have camping. You either go camping or you stay at the hotel. Okay, so you have choices. Um, now, there is some war history here. They used to make poison gas probably about 100 years ago uh, for war purposes. So if you've ever heard of uh, Tomogashima, this is going to be very similar. And there's also the remains of an old power plant. So in addition to rabbits, there's a lot of history. So there's a, there's a lot to see. So let's go. So we found, we found our first rabbit. It's so hot. It's, it's August. It's, it's just so hot. Hi rabbit. Can you, why don't you open the bag? Why don't you give, give some food? Okay, so Atsumi. We have your food. Okay, so Atsumi's got the rabbit food. Let's see if hey. this evokes a response. Hey, hey, hey. Oh, not interested. You're not interested? Hey, rabbit. Throw closer. <laughs> no. She's sweet. Very sleepy. Okay, let's try another rabbit. Bye. Bye. We have two rabbits. Hey, hey, hey. Huh? Oh, they are so hot. They're shaking. Hey, hey, hey. 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 Look, oh. this is. Yeah, this poor thing is so hot because it's August. What's it, girl? Mm. Yeah, maybe you're not hungry at all. Mm. Sanen. Okay, maybe try some different rabbits? Yeah. Okay, so we made it to the first checkpoint of the island. Remains of Nagaura Poison Gas Storehouse. Okay, so the Japanese army had been secretly manufacturing poison gas on this island from 1929. So if you're interested in more history, you can pause the video and just read the rest. But there's the tank. And over here is where you see the actual plant or the storehouse. So it doesn't look like we can go in. There's a wooden fence. That's too bad. But there are some tunnels. And also some rumors that there may be some lingering poison gas after all these decades, but who knows? I still feel pretty good. Yeah. Yeah, that's so cute. <laughs> okay, so it was only supposed to rain for a little bit at some point, and so we got a little unlucky. Uh, I don't know how the acoustics are in here, but it's because we're in a cave. The cave kinda looks like that cave over there. 
So in the war times, maybe though this was where people would actually stay, where they would have their barracks. Um, maybe it was storage. But here's another, here's a look at the tunnel. There's a lot of water down there. There's Atsumi taking this this time out of the rain to stretch. Good job. Okay, so after about a hundred meters or maybe a kilometer or two of uh, hiking, we finally made it to the, the old power plant. Uh, it doesn't look like we're going to be able to get inside though, but at least I'll try and get you some good footage of the outside. Let's take a moment to do a little quiz. Question. What do you think this building produced? 1. Poison gas. 2. Electric power. Or 3. Robots. If you chose number 2, electric power, you'd be correct. What blows my mind about this quiz is that there are drawings of small children on there. And it begs the question, when is it too young to educate your children about poison gas? That's what I want to know. All right, anyway, let's get back to the rabbits. Okay, so now, finally, the chance I've been waiting for this whole trip, I see one, two, three, four, five rabbits, which is about the most I've seen in one spot in the hour or two that Itsumi and I have been walking around this island. So, I have food. I have food. You want food? You want the food? Hello? I have food. Do you want food? Come on. It's food. It's raining food. Come here. Come here. Okay, so thanks for joining us on our trip to Rabbit Island. It's early August. It's 36 degrees Celsius. So it's super hot, it's early afternoon, 
and the rabbits are suffering from heat stroke so they don't really want to come out and play so my recommendation uh, come in the morning come later in the day or wait a few months until the weather the temperature goes down and they'll probably be a lot more active uh, but if you do come during the summer you will see rabbits and you will have fun it's a good hike it's good exercise so by all means please come uh, you'll have a great time so thank you for watching uh, please like and subscribe to my channel thank you very much